guys. How you doing today? Uh, we've been chat. Um, I thought I'd actually talk while I was setting up because I wanted to actually show you the top of my desk. How cool is that? Um, this is actually Matt. It's for a resin, but there goes the light pad. And I'm actually working on something. I'm not sure if you've seen me working on pink and grey galah. This is one I got from Gemma. Uh, hang on, turn it around. Uh, yeah, I got this one from Gemma, and I thought I'd do a whip and chat and chat and while I was setting up. Um, we all have our own little ways of setting up and how we like things to be. And I thought, yeah, I'll just have a chat away. Um, different camera again, <laughs> but that's because my two favourite cameras are actually in position. And I'll see if I can show it to you. Which one is it? That one? It's in position because I am working on some resin. And I don't want to move the cameras because I took a while to get in the right spot. Okay, so. Um, no close-up picture, obviously, because, yes, I have a few cameras, but, um, yeah, I don't always, I don't use them all. But when I've got those, my two favourites in, in use, uh, I do, I am going to need to slip to this one, which is, I don't know how to put it, probably, I oh know it's a good camera, uh, it's, but yeah, not quite my favourite. Okay, so, for those who don't know me, hi, feed, diamond in the rock, um, do a few different crafts, um, and I will say guys, leave me comments below, um, I do this right here, hit the comments below, let me know if you come anything that I say actually resonates with you today because uh, I think there's a couple of interesting things I need to say um, and okay that's something I don't have here on my desk I don't know where I put my metal ruler I can't see it okay well that, that one's can't do that plan okay um, I have to do it this way yeah um, yeah, if anything that I say resonates, you let me know. Give me, give me a comment below. I've just gone through um, and read and replied to everybody's comments for the last about 24 hours. Let's see if I can actually... Shh, I'm just going to try and zoom this if I can. Um... I think that's about as zoomed in as it gets. Okay. Uh, bear with me. Bear with me while I try and get this so that you guys can see a little bit what I'm doing. Just to try and get it look a little bit better. Now I know I've said to Shawana that I, yeah, she wants to see me with my setup and how I use. OBS, so I use Streamlabs OBS, but I will need to record that using a different program <laughs> so that then I can work with the uh, OBS while uh, I can show show how I use the OBS. Okay, oh, okay. Just find the H76. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, a little bit of fun today, got the resin out, and now I can't find my drill tools <laughs> while I set up uh, another one. Okay. But yeah, I had uh, a couple of interesting things, that just scared me, my sprinklers just went off, uh, a couple of interesting things today, so I did the resin work. Um, cooked another Hello Fresh meal which I wasn't sure whether I was going to like it uh, no, I can do it that way, it is that way because I'm not a big one for pepper but it turned out really nice turned out quite yummy so 
sorry, go ahead, hang on. I don't know whether you can hear that. Uh, just shut the window because that sound of the sprinklers was annoying me. Um, yeah, so I cooked that up and now, oh my gosh. Okay, so this is one that's going to resonate with you guys that have got your partners, your hubbies, all that at home. How much are they driving you nuts? Because Nathan, although he is still working, he's not working as much. Okay, so he's he's work he seems to be working less hours. Um, so he's he did build the screen door, <laughs> which yeah, great. But he, then he's like going, you can do this on this, you can you can sand it and paint it on this day. And now he's looking at doing something else to the front of the house, so that he starts it and there's and the, I'll do these bits and then you can do this. So yet again, planning a day um, from when I'm on days off. Uh, you know, like tomorrow, he's turned around and said, well, you can do this tomorrow. And I'm like going, I'm not doing anything tomorrow. Um, tomorrow is, tomorrow is actually my birthday. And with the fact that we can't go out for dinner, um, and because I'm on days off, he's expecting me to cook dinner. We had, that was another interesting conversation. But yeah, what's happening is he's now looking for things to do around the house. But then he does the first bit and wants me to finish off. You know, do the, the painting and, and the, all of that. So now he's just come up with doing um, some woodwork at the front of the house again and hanging planters off it. And I've turned around and I said, well, you do that, we're going to end up with spiders on there and I won't be using the door and you'll have to keep cleaning. Oh, no, we will, we'll, we'll, we'll keep doing it. It's like, well, what about all these cobwebs that are here right now? So, yeah. He's uh, looking at all these different things he can do in the house. Um, me, today, what did I achieve? I had a cooked dinner. Um, no, I actually, where my craft desk was, I've now cleaned that up, uh, got it looking really nice, except the bookcase needs to be sorted out a bit, um, probably spread, spread stuff around because now I'll be holding on to my um, diamond painting and all my storage containers and all that. Um, but yeah, so now he's seen that, he's looked at it and he's, no, no, if we do this, we do this and we do this. And he's one of these people that's not, not that he will do it, he says we will. And it usually, by him saying we, men's, tends to mean that he wants me to do it. Guys, how many of you guys have got partners like that? Yeah, hubbies and that, or partners that are actually, will do it, but then that we generally means for some the other person to do it. Yeah, but yeah, at the moment I'm starting to think with the less time that he's been at work, he's going to be at home and he's going to become a pain in the bum. And we're watching, something came on the news tonight about, um, you know, absence makes a heart grow fonder, so what's happening now with relationships? <laughs> because everybody is at home. <laughs> and I just about choked on my dinner because I'm already, although Nathan's not fully at home and I'm still working, I'm already noticing it and it's not even fully affecting us. Yeah. Um, he, he, yeah, that's it. But he, yeah, it's, it's gonna be a struggle for us if, if he ends up having to stay at home. Because I enjoy my days off when he's not here. I get that peace and quiet, I get to do what I want. I, I didn't do that much today. I think I fell asleep on the couch at 11 o'clock this morning. I woke up at three o'clock, it was great. Not good to do, but it was great. It was, then I still achieve stuff around the house, it was good. So yeah. Um, I had a, went through the 
comments I've received in the last 24 hours. Um, so Claudia's um, turned around, she put a comment saying that she um, doesn't normally comment, but thank you Claudia, I do appreciate the comments. And Kathy, I always chuckle with Kathy's comments. Kathy's um, comments, Kathy, you, I reckon with your comments, you should do your own YouTube channel because some of the stuff that you're doing is just awesome to hear. Um, and it looks like you have a big list of things to do so that while you're stuck at home, you've got a big plan of stuff to do. Um, I will admit that I have done the clean the oven and clean the pantry. But yeah, they're lots of fun. But yeah, keeping busy. Um, yeah, I've got a couple of interesting ones that you've know, got names like trying to get people to sub to subscribe to them, which is really annoying. And Rivka, thank you. Yes, the geisha is turning out gorgeous. Um, and Tazzy Devil didn't mess it up that time. Uh, her, nice hearing how you're adjusting is changing how you live. Workers adjusting to the downturn on income, even working in the fuel industry doesn't exempt us from reduced contract uh, contract hours. Well, more craft time, Dan Chan. Yeah. Um, yeah, I have to... I don't know whether I mentioned it before. I... Not the block just happened, the block before, on my first night shift, I got an email from HR to tell me my contract conditions had changed. Um, I actually received a pay increase. So in this climate to get a pay increase, I was rather surprised. Um, yeah, I think I did say, you know, I spoke to my supervisor and she, she said, it's nothing to do with what's going on now. It's something that we've been looking at for the train controllers that the new, newer train controllers, it's our way of saying, you know, we are looking at your salary, we are trying to do what we can. We can only increase you a little bit by a little bit um, because we don't want you to leave. And at the moment, um, because, how do we put it, train controllers and train drivers and that don't always live in the same location. Uh, as in some people live in other states and just come to work for a short for three or f for four or five days and then go home um, and with that if people are doing that some people are actually stuck over east because you can't get to the west coast because of the um, the ban on people coming in uh, and the fact that if you come in from another state of Australia to WA, you've got your two two week quarantine. Uh, so you know they're trying to do what they can to make sure that we don't leave where we are to go to another company that might be struggling for train controllers as well, because uh, they're finding yeah there's a lot of talk about people jumping because the jobs are there. Uh, okay, so yeah, um, I, I'm very fortunate that I've, I, I've just got a pain crest, which is really, in this climate, is really amazing. Um, what else is going on? What else is going on? Not really that much else. I've got more resin, um, so I should finish that tomorrow because that's going to take like 24 hours to set. Just something that I brought the mould a while ago, and I thought I couldn't quite tell what size it was, so I just did it. I just got it to see what size it was like. Um, it's not really that big, so I've got to work out what I'm going to store in it. But I, until I actually make it, I can't really gauge the proper size of it. It's a H there. Um, so yeah, you know, it's just. Once it comes out, we'll see. Might hold some stuff, you know. I don't know. But, hey, you know, that's something I'm doing with resin. 
it actually that does actually have um, drills in it. I use drills. I put glitter in the resin and then I put drills in the resin as well. So it'll be interesting to see how that comes out. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh, Nathan, I'm going backwards and forwards with Nathan. Um, Nathan wanted to, me to go to Bunnings with him tonight. So, you know, the, the good old stay at home and less essential. It doesn't seem to grasp his, he doesn't seem to grasp it because he hears about people on TV going out and doing things and he's there going, oh, they should be staying at home. And then he's there saying, oh, I'm going to go to Bunnings, are you going to come with me? And I was like, I'm staying at home. <laughs> yeah. He just doesn't grasp that concept, you know, and then he gets disappointed because I say I'm staying at home. Well, it's the way he is. Warts and all, I have to put up with him. Just might have to put up with him while I'm up days off. Um, so he's, what have we got? Today is Thursday. So tomorrow, Friday, he'll be home. Highly likely Saturday and Sunday. And then I'll go to work on Monday. So, yeah. Let's see how that goes. Um, and so there's nothing no ta being taken out for dinner or anything my birthday and it looks like I'm expected to cook as well <laughs> hang on a sec sprinklers are finished um I don't know if you can hear the neighbours kids. I can hear them. They're not as loud as the sprinklers. Um, yeah. Be interesting to see whether he decides he's going to do something for dinner or not. I do have the home Hello Fresh stuff. If he doesn't do anything, I might just do burgers. I don't know. Don't know. Ah. What else have I got? Oh, so now I've moved into the craft room. Um, <laughs> Nathan's like going, do you, do you, "What are you going to do? You don't. You're not going to. You normally you know, sit at your desk and sit and watch TV." Have I just been doing the wrong symbol? Hang on. No, I haven't. Just for a moment there, the H's look like ends. Um, so I mean where I sit where I used to sit I used to sit where I can see the TV and I'd have the TV on but I wouldn't really be watching it um, because I'd be watching YouTube or Netflix or Stan or Pro Amazon Prime be watching something but not necessarily the TV because the TV does the TV actually kills background noise um, and before I started recording this, I had the craft room door open. I had the door open, thinking, yep, yeah, I'll do a recording with the door open. Yeah. Nathan's in the front room, and I can hear him talking on the phone. Next symbol. Uh, three. I'm going to find something that's, I don't want the, do I want the arrow down? Where's the arrow down? Arrow up, arrow down. Um, he's on the phone in the front room and I thought, well, I'll see if I can hear him. So I hit the record button on my camera, on my program, on my computer. And yep. Yeah. Without me saying anything, I you know I recorded for about twenty seconds, and without me saying anything, I could hear the full conversation of he was having on the phone. <laughs> um, so I was hoping that in my craft room I could just go in the craft room, come in the room, do more recordings. Wouldn't have to shut the door. Uh, but yep, I need to shut the door when he's home. Now. 
I shouldn't be complaining. Well, I'm not really complaining, I'm more letting you know. Like this room, so as soon as I was out, as soon as the sprinklers turned off, I had to open that um, the window because with the resin, there's a still a smell in the room of the resin. I have been burning candles every day to try and help get rid of that. Um, the smell is slowly fading. But then, what did I do today? I used more resin in here, so I've got the resin smell back again, but not as bad. And that's going to be cool when it's done. Um, I am what about 20 minute. There we go, I've hit about the 20 minute mark. I will, let's see if I can, it is still soft. I will pick this up. So this is what I'm working on. So that's the bottom. That will end up hollow. But I've used a range of uh, different drill colours. Square ones to actually give it a little bit of a character with the glitter. Right. So that'll be cool. Hopefully I can put this back in the same spot. So you setting. Uh, so stay tuned for that video that's uh, should be putting that together tomorrow um, night. I don't know if you heard that. Nathan just yawned. I heard him. <laughs> um, to you guys, I will say um, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Um, see how you're going. Leave me a comment. You know, Tell me about your day, what you've done. It's nice to be able to... Uh, no, 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 no. Hang on. Yep, yeah, I've just got the wrong one then. Oh, I hate arrows in all sorts of directions. Um, yeah, let me know how your day's going. Whether you're chilling, how you're ready to throttle your partner because they're just annoying you just for being there <laughs> and you're not getting peace and quiet. Are you getting your craft time interrupted? It's an interesting time to start going back to recording when he's home, but Hey, I'm back. Um, still haven't heard anything on my Sophie and Toffee box. And, oh, I placed a couple of orders for some diamond paintings today. I have gone with Treasure Art Studios and I have bought from Pretty Neat Creative. Now I did purchase something from them a while ago when I first started. I'll see what my opinion on, on them is uh, when that arrives. I think they were one of the first videos, uh, one of the one of the earliest first videos I did, because they were the one of the pe first people that I, um, first companies I ordered from. So we'll see how that goes. But with the COVID-19 going on, obviously freight's going to take a while. It will get there. So guys, I will leave it there and I will continue to drill away and uh, I will talk to you later and uh, bye for now.